Hi everyone, welcome to the installation tutorial for OpenSchool. Here I'll be walking you through the basics of getting your license key details, downloading the package and installing the OpenSchool application. Before we start, make sure you have purchased a license and have a local cloud server set up to host your OpenSchool application. Let's get started. Right now, you're on the home page of your OpenSchool account. You can view your licenses, profile details and also download your application from here. The license center allows you to do that. Click on the manage licenses link to view all the license keys you have purchased. You can see the license key, its status and details of installation if you've used it. Click on the download application link to view the download link for your package. The green download button initiates your download. The application files are saved to your computer as a zip file. This can later be moved to your server and extracted and used for installation. Let's get started with the installation process now. So I've set up the OpenSchool application files that I was able to download from my OpenSchool account onto my server. As you can see, running it on my browser displays the installation page. Go ahead and enter your license key that you have purchased. Next. Enter the email ID you've used to register with us to purchase this key. Click start to initiate the process. Entering the right details will take you to step 1 of the installation procedure. Make sure all system checks are ok and that you have read the license agreement before moving on. Step 2 is where you enter the database details for the application. The host is usually localhost unless you're using a remote database, in which case you will have to enter the server address of it. The system generates the database automatically if you enter the root user credentials, so all you have to do is enter a desired database name, the root user name, and the password for it, and click next. Check the box to install some sample data in your system if required, else just click next to move on. Now this step might take a few seconds to a couple of minutes depending upon your server. So we're almost done with the installation now. Step 4 includes registering your school details with the license key you've just used. So go ahead and enter your school name, address, country, etc. in the form and click register. We're down to the final step of installation. As you can see, the super admin credentials have been generated. That's a random password. Make sure you make a note of it before moving on. Click the get started link to move on to your application. Use the credentials from the previous screen to log in. There, now you're ready to start digitizing your institution with OpenSchool. Thanks for watching.